who's going to struggle to pay for doctor's visits, to pay for insulin, to pay for the supplies even necessary to test his blood? And he would call me and he would tell me he was struggling. And he felt like he was in a hole. He would never dig himself out of it. American people have got to stand up right now and make it clear that no American should die because they cannot afford their medicine. Their health care is a human right, not a person. We need a national bill of rights written by tenants like me to forever change the balance of the power between us and these so-called landlords. In March, my entire neighborhood was evicted to make room for a shopping center. I feel the pain of that eviction to this day. Just yesterday morning, I was driving my sister to school and we sat and cried in my car for 10 minutes because she looked over at me and she said three words. She said, I miss it. I learned on the streets of Ferguson, you have to protect your neighbor, you protect your sibling, you protect even a complete stranger because nobody is safe until we're all safe. I believe that we all can win. Thank you. Yeah.